Okay, this is for backup CPU. Uh, he wanted to know if I could use the candle as a power source as well as the light source for the trigger on this uh, little pulse motor. And I, I was successful in doing it. Uh, there's the candle with the felt a sandwiched between a heat sink and a piece of copper. And uh, there it is running. I had to add a second coil to it on the other side of the rotor. And this is this same uh, Darlington pair, but I put another coil over here in series, and that increased the resistance double, of course, and gave me push on both sides of the rotor. And then, of course, instead of the battery here, I've got the felt A running off the heat of the candle and differentiated with air temperature with the heat sink. And uh, it's a couple of felt A's in series, and those uh, ones you get off eBay. I can't remember what the specs are on it, but it gives you enough uh, amperage and voltage to make this little uh, pulse motor go. And of course the candle light, now you can see it in the camera, there's the infrared, is, is allowing the light source that blinks off of those magnets as they go around. And that just uh, gives a blink off of the uh, the candle light and gets it going. Anyway, that's for backup CPU. It's something that uh, can be done. Not easy, but it can be done. Thanks for watching.